Hello again everyone, Age of Dune here, and we're back with another StarCraft 2 ranked game. Gonna be Zerg this time, and hopefully I'll be able to do as well as the guy in the last video did against me. Because that guy just kicked butt. Uh, he was also, uh, I was Protoss, he was Zerg, so let's see if we can recreate that, but this time me being the Zerg and him being the Protoss, because that was pretty awesome. I definitely need to make sure to tech two Corruptors. I forgot about that the last time I was Zerg against a Protoss, which was really silly of me, honestly. I mean, you know, Corruptors are really, really good versus the Colossi. And had I had that, that game would have gone way different, but I, I didn't. So yeah, on the plus side, this map is huge, so I will definitely be going for a bit of an early expansion here. I may actually do... Expand before pool, honestly. I think I will. Because, it, like I said, it's huge. And more likely... Oh, no, don't do that. We that first. More than likely, he won't actually be able to get to me before uh, my spawning pool gets done that way. There we go. Get that going. Carry on. Carry on my way with sun. Yes, I might have done that. Alright, um. There's my expansion. We're gonna go ahead and send things down there. Oh, crap. <laughs> the right part of my screen did not latch on. So that was a little bit of a panic mode there for a second. Yep. Yeah. Alright, you. Go ahead and come on over. We're gonna go ahead and go for that early expand here. Watch him do like a proxy gate or something. That would suck. There we go. Got that coming along. Next up will be the spawning pool. At 200. We require more minerals. There we go. Not too bad. And there's that. Next up, of course, will be an extractor. Get that going, because those are pretty useful, you know? And then this, there we go. Also, when I go ahead and get an overlord on the way here, so that once my spawning pool has popped, I can go ahead and pump out an a, or a queen, not unqueen. Not an, there's only one. Oh, the grammar. Okay, so let's go ahead and build a roach warren, uh, uh, that. okay, build a roach warren down there and build at least one thing of those. Also want to go ahead and get that started. There we go. We require more minerals. More minerals, more minerals. We require more minerals. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna lose this guy, so I'm gonna go ahead and queue up another one already. And he's going to let it stand. So I did not end up lo oh, never mind, never mind, it's gone. Alright. I did actually go ahead and make two stalkers there. And there we go. He is actually attacking here. This guy around a bit here. And get another queen to pop out. Send this guy over. And get another overlord on the way as well. Also want to do this, but unfortunately don't have the overlords for it. But this guy's not going to be able to take that out, I believe. Yeah, I know. Spawn more overlords. Shut up. Okay, there we go. So I did actually manage to fend that off, and I actually didn't really lose much at all. I lost a single uh, Zergling, which honestly, I am 100% okay with. Not not Zergling, uh, worker thing. 
get another one of these going here. I'm a bit low on workers, actually. So I definitely need to pump out a lot more of them. Just kind of hold it down for the bit. I, I put a lot into resource, uh, into, uh, I put a lot of money into my army here, which, while not a terrible thing, it did definitely put me behind. So I need to definitely work on churning out a whole bunch of drones here because I'm going to need them. Yeah, this guy will be my my creep pooper. All right, I also want to get this started as soon as I've got the minerals, but I'm not. I'm kind of just continuing to rush these the uh, drones here because I really need them. But I, I really need this as well. So let's get that started. Next up, I will do one overlord. There we go. Come on, you should have enough energy. It just popped. There we go. You go come here. That thing can go there. And need another herb lord. It's on the way, but there we go. Excellent. Okay, so I've got plenty of stuff coming out. The, uh, the fast expand there, that's a large part of why I was a little bit behind there. But in the long run, in theory, it should actually put me ahead, which is good. Because that's kind of what I need there. We require more minerals. Alright, any new guys are going to come down here. And let's get started on this as well. And let's tear that nothing. You're done. Alright, good. So I'm going to go ahead and get started on a Hydralis den here. Do that. Had a momentary panic there as I heard fighting and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm under attack. No, I'm not under attack. I was just being a derp. So hopefully he's not uh, attacking me at the moment. That would be very unfortunate. Not attacking me anytime soon, really. Let's see. Hydralis Den is up now. I'm going to put out some Hydras here. And then some more of those. They just did. They're on the way. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and send this guy on over and expand here. Because having expansions of Zerg is actually pretty darn important. As is creep spread. You come here. You're going to go ahead and make me a spire because I really need that. And I need this as well. Get that extra range going. And now. Oh. Get out some more. Yeah, yeah, more minerals. But that's okay. I'm actually coming along really nicely here. I do want to go ahead and get this started. And. Just kind of continue working on these. Okay, so he's got... That actually is doing some damage here. So that is a real one, interestingly enough. But he's about to lose it if he doesn't pay attention. Unfortunately, he is indeed paying attention. But we're going to go ahead and do this. Because I'm kind of worried about that. The fact that he was, he actually does have that coming in. Especially, uh, given the fact that he actually has attacked so far. Oh, sorry. That, 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 that. And let's get some more, more guys. Alright, get that started. And I need to go ahead and get me a couple of these as well. Put one of these here. There we go. Coming along pretty nicely here. And now this guy can go ahead and start doing this. Oops. As soon as the creep spreads enough. There we go. This is actually going pretty well so far. I think this may actually be a decent game for me. That's what I'm hoping anyway. 
Let's see, I've got 15 guys here. Let's go ahead and send them here. And we need to get started on that. And carry on with the creep spread here. Creep spread pretty important. I, I've been neglecting it. Mostly because I don't even think about it. It's not an intentional neglect or anything like that. It's just I don't think about it, so I don't do it. Go ahead and expand again. He's not harassing me at all, which is great for me. And that's giving me time to go ahead and pump out a lot of stuff here. You're already done with everything, which is great. You guys, come on up here. I do want to go ahead and do this. Make that move faster. And... You guys. Let's go ahead and transform these guys into a few overlords here. There we go. And I think... Let's go ahead and send these guys over here really quick. Go ahead and take that down. And then I can go ahead and expand again. There's that, and we're going to launch another expansion over to here now. And of course, spawn more overlords, spawn more overlords. I am really doing bad with my uh, overlord management this game. Let's get a decent number of them again, or, or queue up some more of them again, I mean. Let's get some of those. So I'm having a problem with that. Alright, that is done, so let's get attacks two. And don't have enough gas for that yet. Um, I do have a Zergling. Let's, let's send him up here just to see what's here. Okay. So he doesn't have vision there. So I'm actually getting pretty close to having a full force here. And at that point in time, I may end up launching an attack, although I probably won't quite right, or quite off the bat, but fairly shortly after. All right, that's going well. So far, everything's going pretty darn well. Hopefully, when the engagement finally happens, it will continue to go. Alright. It's pretty much going to be right about now, honestly. I, I do want to go ahead and queue up some more of those. So if he does manage to go ahead and attack, or if, if he does manage to wipe out my army, I'll have a ton of those. And I won't have enough gas at the moment. Hmm. Let's go ahead and queue that up. Or get that going, I mean. Not queue it up, but... Okay, so he does have an army here, or a, a base here, sorry. Let's pull his guys out here. And then... Okay. So that happened. And I should, I think, be able to go ahead and do this. Yeah, because he, uh... He definitely got a little... Out of position there. Oh crap. Let's get these guys away from that. Okay, and get that going again. Bring him out again. Not quite yet. Okay. Well, that's fine. I do have a lot of guys coming out. And I think he does not. Let's go ahead and do that. Don't have that. That's fine. I'm just going to let it be because I'm going to launch another attack here. Because uh, I've got a huge army again. Or I will very shortly.
send all these guys over here. Okay. I think I can come out of this ahead. Pretty sure. Yeah. I definitely did just come out of this ahead. I think I have won this. There we go. Get these guys up here all the way. His forces are gone. And I've got more streaming down. I do want to go ahead and queue up some more of these while my forces are just kind of uh, destroying things on their own. And I'm just going to continue with the attack here. we go. I am inside of his base now. Let's go ahead and burst this down as fast as possible. We've got a ton of resources here, so we'll do that again. And supply limit. But uh, I, I really don't think it matters by now. I, I think this is gonna be GG. I cannot see any way that he could do come back from this. But I mean, it's always possible, I guess. I'm really doubtful, but whatever. So maybe maybe he's doing like I always do and just sitting there talking to people. Maybe he's actually recording the match as well. All right, GG. So yeah, I actually did manage to do what I did or what was done to me in my last video, which is macro like man and just win. Just dominate. Look at this. Uh, one, two, three, four. And I think, well actually, I want to see exactly how many bases he he had here. So, let's go ahead and just uh, explore that. I know apparently he's not here. He does have a base here. And he's got, well, he had a base here. But, I'm not sure what else he had actually. So I, I do want to see that. He had a pretty big, well, he had a lot of guys here mining, which is good for him. But, uh, unfortunately for him, when I saw his yeah, army here... I immediately went ahead and went around it. He also had a base down here. Wow, that was actually a really nasty looking base too. But that was all he had. Okay, so he was a four base versus a five base Zerg. And when uh, when I saw his army here, like I meant, like I was saying there, I came down here and that caught his army out of position. And then I like, I had a ton of larva, so I was able to go ahead and just macro pretty much my entire army instantly again and then send them on down. So I'm pretty happy with the way that went. That actually was really good. It says 23 minutes. That was not 23 minutes, by the way. Blizzard time's weird. Um, yay for decals. I don't know, I don't really care about decals. Um, let's see, APM, I was actually at 67 average APM and uh, 79 workers created, so that's actually not bad at all. I'm pretty happy with that. My time supply capped, I am not happy about. I spent a lot of time supply capped in that video. That kind of sucked. But, uh, let's see. Army value, I was way above him. He actually stopped production here. And then, uh, that's where his army met mine, and he just lost from there. Let's see. Workers active. He, he had more than me. And he had a lot better resource collection. Upgrade spending, I was higher than him by far. So that helped me as well. That, you know, and just having the better army value. He almost, he actually did decimate my army, destroy my army almost with his, uh, size storms. Those are very nicely placed. So, hey, I, I won though, and I'm happy. So that's going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Have a good night. Bye.